welcome to the Startup Espresso. I'm Hall T. Martin, the host of the show, where we talk about raising funding for your startup and the time it takes to have an espresso. I hope you enjoy this episode. Hello, this is Hall T. Martin with the Startup Funding Espresso, your daily shot of startup funding and investing. In a fundraise, one typically uses the same term sheet throughout the raise. From time to time, investors will demand certain rights and conditions. If there are no investor representations, then you may be able to do so. For some investors, you may need to vary the terms of the raise and use a different term sheet. The key is to keep the valuation the same, but add additional terms to make the deal more attractive. Additional terms include most favored nation status, which means the investor gets the best deal that anyone else in the round gets. It could also include advisory and board positions, warrants, or redemption rights. Lean investors often ask for special terms to compensate for their time and effort. Investors spending time mentoring the team also may ask for these considerations. Before changing the terms or using new term sheets, you should check with your attorney. Thank you for joining us for the Startup Funding Espresso, where we help startups and investors connect for funding. Let's go start up something today. Paul T. Martin is the director of Investor Connect, which is a 501c3 nonprofit dedicated to the education of investors for early stage funding. All opinions expressed by Hall and podcast guests are solely their own opinions and do not reflect the opinion of Investor Connect. This podcast is for informational purposes only and should not be relied upon as a basis for investment decisions.